Hey there YouTube fans, Kuhn's on here, and welcome to this new Let's Play. Um, this is a game that I've been kind of excited to Let's Play, because I had a feeling I'd eventually do so, and, well, now I am. Um, it's gonna be a completely blind run of this game, and, ironically enough, it's part of a series, and I've never played one of the games from that series. So, this is gonna be interesting. Um, and you there, looking at the title, stop cheating. You're supposed to be in suspense here, or something like that. Anyway, uh, come on. Thank you. Okay. Yes, GameCube games on the Wii, for the win. Just hope I don't make a racket getting out my GameCube controller. Um, so yeah, I'm sure you are. Oh, what the heck was that? Weirdo Wii, whatever. Uh, and this game contains violence and gore. Capcom? <gasps> Never. Capcom game. Hmm. Whatever could it be? Oh, that wasn't very nice. Resident Evil. Yes. This is my first actual Resident Evil game. Um, I'm not quite counting 4 or 5, because, well, I hardly played 4. And 5, even though I beat it, it does not play the same way. So, um, now, I have watched these games before, uh, this game before, a little bit. And a little bit is really an understatement. I have problems paying attention to this game for some reason. And I've only actually watched Jill before. I've watched Jill like a hundred bajillion times. It's just that it just hasn't. I've never watched it before for Chris. So, uh. Whatever, I'll just use the default. What? No, I don't want to reset the game. Okay, so let's start. Resident so, Evil. since I want to be as blind as possible, I'm going to play as Chris. And, uh, I'm gonna play on mountain climbing since that seems like normal mode. So, Chris Redfield, I am you. Chris Redfield. July 1998, Raccoon Forest. Not Bravo Team. Not the Raccoon Forest. Not Bravo Team. Not Bravo Team. Not Bravo Team. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about 10 people. Victims were apparently. Nom, nom, nom. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. The Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. Not a nightmare. I hate those things. Joseph. There's Jill. Fudge squirrel. Stop overreacting. Pond. I think he's dead.
Aw, puppies. Come on. I believe in the uh, original, this scene was like actually like live action, which is like unheard of for a video game these days. He said a curse word. Chris, this way. Hmm, who's that? Looks kind of familiar. Enter the survival horror. I've heard this game controls awkwardly, and oh my god, it does. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm going to die. Will you take the ink ribbon? Sure. I think we need ink ribbons to save. We. It's blood. There are blood stains on the floor. Hope these didn't come from your friends. They're not my friends, they're Chris's friends. No, come on, go through the door, Chris. Thank you. Off to a good start already. Can you control him? Hmm, how do I attack? Oh, I only have a knife. That's kind of not good. Oh. Is it snack time, I suppose? What's he eating, anyway? Oh, hello there, gorgeous. How pretty. You could be a model. Uh, yeah, run away, Chris. Chris, run. Run away. Run away. Thank you. Yay, I ran away. I feel so special. But I'm not. Uh, I'm so going to get myself owned. Yeah, I, I had mentioned, like, zombie dodging before, but I doubt I'd be able to do it. These controls are, like, wonky. Why would they have an ink ribbon and a typewriter in the dining room, anyway? That's what I'd like to know. Wesker? Jill? Where did they go? I don't know, Chris. Pick up the gun, Chris. Thank you. Will you take the handgun? Of course. Uh, let's try going in one of these doors then, I guess. Oh, come on. In there. Shiny. I have to like stand on something and get up there. Uh, woman drawing water. Okay. Don't care about what the picture is called. I'd like a like ladder or something, please. But I guess they're not going to be so kind as to give me one. So let's just push this out of the way. 